What up? <laughs> what up, your mo's? Your mo mo's? Oh, man, the truth. The truth is everywhere. Look around. You'll see the truth, dude. It's blaringly obvious. The truth makes me see it. I'm drinking baby group. Baby group was grinded and put in this cup for me to drink because I'd feed off the sickness. Mm. Yes. It's just you and me, Jeremy. It's just you and me, brother. Hopefully the ads will be over with once uh, the election's over. Dude, my, everywhere I look, it's ads. My day is going great. I just woke up. My leg was asleep. I got a doorbell ring. Hopefully the day continues like this. But this is a slab unboxing. CGC. Got it right here. Here we go. I've been getting books graded for like probably about eight years. You guys, maybe longer. So I can definitely be a trusted source, you guys. Just because I only been on YouTube for two years doesn't mean I don't know what's going on with grading. I would say out of the bunch, I know more than everybody. But, you know, that's just me. My dogo can't help you. My dogo's barking. We'll start with my um, returns. So, you know, I haven't been too particular. I, I know how to spot a 9-8. Um... So my guess is anything returned was damaged during shipping or um, handling, not on my end, but we'll look at the returns because I think it's important that you see what, what happened, why these books, I want to know. You know what I do with returns? I throw them away because I have so many comics I won't throw these away, though. I might try to fix them because these are good books. I actually do have a website, economicsandcomics.com. I, I set it up, but it just refers you back here just so I could have the .com. So here are my returns. Yep. Nothing wrong with this book except right. This is a nine six all day. There's like a little, like someone grabbed it right here, right? Someone grabbed it right here. So it wasn't me. So that that's an easy fix, and that book's worth some money. So there's no reason to dump it. Uh, real rude. It's it's all here. I do it all here. I do it all here. So just turn on your notifications, my brother. Yep. Someone grabbed it right here. Dude, these are these are someone damaged this. I didn't damage these. Everything else is perfect on here. That's an easy press fix. But I, I know a hundred percent I didn't send that in like that. Same, same spot. So simple. So simple. These books are fine. I could sell those at nine sixes all day long. Okay, so. Yeah, probably JRK. They didn't pop up because um, 
I just automatically went live. No one really knows. You can tell there's 16 people in here. If I had scheduled it, I scheduled it 10 minutes ago. So it's just a quick unboxing because I have it and I can go live and do it. Okay, here we go. This could be a boring video. Okay. But I'm going to tell show you what money looks like. <laughs> okay. This is what money looks like. This is when you send the right. Uh, no, nah, I didn't take pictures, Brian. I, I don't have time. Um, this is what happens when um, you know what you're doing. Okay. Now, a lot of you guys are very lucky because this is the lucky 13 box. Everyone that pre-ordered, I want to show you something. Remember I said the Lucky 13 box is going to come with a slab. You have chances to win prizes. And then you're getting a trade and two exclu some exclusives along with the Lucky 13. I've already packed the 13 comics. I put them separate in the Gemini, which I'll put inside the box. So today, probably during elections, I'm going to pack everything that everyone ordered. And it all goes out tomorrow morning. So good luck to you guys. You should be getting your lucky 13 boxes by the end of the week. And here it is. This is how you, you make money. Or how, how you pro do it right. Okay. 9-8. There's a trade. Okay. That's one of the lucky 13s. My phone won't stop beeping. Please stop beeping. Please stop beeping. So there's one of the 13. <coughs> you got to send the right books in. People just grab books and say, I just still don't get it. You'll see it all day long. Number two, lucky 13. Nine, eight. These are not cheap. These are not cheap. This book, I am telling you, this book, it, book, besides the book in the cover and all that, is going to skyrocket. I'm telling you right now. That's the best variant for that book. Number three. These are all going into the sick boxes and are shipping them out tomorrow morning. Priority. Number four, there was 13 of them, so I got to, these are all Comics Elite Kyle Hotz variants. Number five, got to pack all these, perfect timing. I mean, like, consider, like, I'm not sure what they're worth, probably 80 to 100, and then the virgins are worth a shitload more. I'm set by 25, well, almost 25. Number six. All oh, my lucky 13s. There it is. All oh, your books. I'm not gonna even they're gonna stay in the bag or they're gonna get they're gonna get bubble wrapped and they're gonna be shipped straight from me to you. Number seven. Let me see here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Eight. Nine. You know where those are going for like a, almost $100 raw? I'm telling you, dude, when they do the gauntlet, dude... When they do the Infinity Gauntlet or Finley Hammer, shit, dude, this book's gonna skyrocket, dude. 10? I think that's 10. There was 13 of them. 1, 2, 4, 6, 8, 10. 11. Twelve, dude, nine eight. That's it, dude. I don't want anything except nine eight. I don't want anything with nine eight. I think some of these I press fix too. 
And 13. So these were the people that got the lucky 13 box. You're each getting one of these. <clears throat> now, the prize winners won, like, a bunch of stuff back there. You can't see. I've got it all separated and ready. And then first prize got a uh, – well, hey, let me see here. I want to show you something. 14. I had 14 trades, and I sold 13, so I could keep one. So, yeah, I, keep, I get one. Thanks. <laughs> See it. Okay, now. First prize got a virgin. So there's one virgin. Two virgin. Somebody's hoarding virgins. They won't be virgin for long. <laughs> Three. Four. Five. Six, seven. So I have seven virgins. So then I go. <laughs> yes, yes, yes. Sick. I'm feeling super sick right now. Okay, so one of these was first prize. So that goes to Marcos. I'm putting it over there. So that leaves me with six. I'm selling one to Comic Joel. Comic Joel didn't want to get mixed up in a lucky 13. He wanted to be separated. So I'm selling one to him. So I'm keeping five virgins. And one trade. <clears throat> and let's not forget. There's one more book in here. I bought 50. Okay. I got like 35 trade and 15 virgin, okay? I bought 50. Uh, then I got, uh, I sold some trades. Some trades are in a sick box I have that I'm still winning for X swords. People are still waiting on those. Um, and the, but, but getting 50, I got this. Oh, yeah, baby. <laughs> Pre got my 1 in 50, pressed it. 9.8. So, of course, I'm keeping that, too. Sick. Sick. Dude, it's almost as big as my awesome hat right now. Dude, I was looking for my hat last night on eBay to try to get a new one so I could frame this one. This guy's got some old... This guy's got some wear on him. He needs to be framed. 1 in 50 for the old Billy Bob. Now, I have been collecting slabs. I have... I have another four orders at CGC, and I've got another three orders at CBCS. <clears throat> um, but I have like four boxes of slabs. One day I'm just going to go live and have like a massive slab auction. Uh, <clears throat> how can plebes... <clears throat> well... I would start with the usual suspects. First, I would ask my parents. Then I would ask my girlfriend or boyfriend. And then I would take it upon myself to figure out how to, let's say, get a book for cheap. Not cheap, but go find like a key for a store code. Do a little research, try to get a good deal on it. Sell it on eBay for double or whatever it's worth. Make sure you're doing the right research. And then take that money and go back and buy something else. And then do it again and do it again and do it again and do it again until 
dude, you have a bunch of money. I want to show you something. I can't show you that. I'm not going to show you that. I almost did. <laughs> that would have been crazy to see this what happens early in the morning. So, um, yeah. Pretty stoked. Pretty, pretty stoked today. Um, that's one hell of a, a haul. That's one hell of a haul. Every once in a while, I will. But, uh, dude, it takes up so much time. I really don't. I'd rather refer you to somebody that does that. Um, here, I'll show you something. So you take the, what we call money, okay? Try to get your hands on a $20 bill. Go to a comic book store and try to find the key and 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 look at it. Try to grade it and and look what the price is on eBay and say, okay, this book is worth $20 on eBay in this grade. And then you go and you go, dude, this book is not that great. You tell them, uh, I'll give you half. See if you can walk out with half. And then you, you go back and you make it pretty and then you sell it. Or double. So, uh, Jeremy asked to show the pickup of the day yesterday. Oh my God. So, yesterday I was in a, a video uh, on location at this place and I saw this print. Or not a print. It was in a frame. It's Jessica Rabbit and Roger Rabbit as uh, Legend of Zelda. And I, it was $15. And I asked the guy on the wall, I said, How, is that $15? He said, yeah. So I want it. So I took it out of the frame. And uh, you can tell it's an original, right? watercolor so last night i had a fun event where i asked people to find out who it was because i couldn't find it the guy's name is james silvani found him he's got like eight thousand followers i'm gonna try to get him on the show but on the back of this on the back of this of the frame itself it said 150 dollars. <laughs> but anyway dude i had to buy it because it's super fire it's really well done if you want to check out his work, look up James Silvani. Uh, so, real quick, someone was asking me, uh, real rude six asked if I would ever press and submit for the followers. Is that a thing? Um, sometimes I press, very rarely. I won't submit for you guys. It's just too much of a pain in the ass, depending. But uh, here's why I'm saying this again is because you can check out Gamma Ray's comics right here. Uh, he presses books. That he does, I, I, I'm guessing a lot. Or like not, maybe not for a living, but he's. I don't have time. He does. Check out Gamma Ray's comics, you guys. Um, if you want to submit books, uh, Gamma, you're still doing that, right? If you want to get books us uh, uh, pressed and stuff. But yeah, here. Um, here's the piece. I really do love it a lot. I love Jessica Rabbit. Oh, I also have something else I want to show you guys before we get off. Uh, you know, guys, I do my FOC videos. Um, I do my FOC videos every Thursday. Hang on, I gotta. I want to give you a little tease of what's going to be coming every Thursdays besides you guys. Oh my God. When you see this, you're going to shit your panties. I promise. I know I did. Hang on. I got to download it so you can see. I'll just give you a tease. Hang on. I'll give you a tease.
So I'm curious, how many of uh, how many of you people uh, watch my FOC video live on Thursday night? It's probably one of the most important videos uh, for everyone to save money. Okay, uh, so dude, I, I just this just happened, and I didn't really have. You can't say no to somebody sometimes, and I'm going to show you why. So you know how on that, you know how on New Comic Day I have Comic Joel, right? New Comic Day we have Comic Joel and Short Books. Well, FOC video we're going to have something special too now. And for all you other channels out there, get ready to copy this too, okay? That's right. Uh, that's right. <laughs> Dude, Steph, Amazon cosplayer. Uh, this is just a secret to you guys. She's going to be making a cosplay cameo on FOC nights. I don't know when she's going to come on. Uh, she's going to she's going to dress up. <laughs> and she's going to well, go through the books Uh Maybe she'll talk to you guys or say stuff, uh, but dude, we're going to have a cosplay cameo. Uh, I don't know when, like I might be doing a video and then all of a sudden cosplay cameo comes on. And so that's going to be fire. Okay. First ever again to YouTube. First ever. Here's what I, here's my prediction for all the copiers. Okay. I'm looking at you. Here's my prediction. You're going to start doing tons of coupon codes. If you already haven't started, you're going to start saying you're getting sponsors by all these people. Right? Or uh, giving out codes. Because because why wouldn't you? You know, why wouldn't you want to help other people? I guess I'm the only one still. And secondly, the next thing you see is people having cosplayers on their channel with them okay watch mark my words first sickest truth truth is the most important thing so that's it um everyone that this unboxing everyone that got the lucky 13 i don't let me say something before i go so you guys understand i'm gonna package all your stuff and get it shipped out in the monday mornings in the sh or tomorrow morning's gonna ship out so you should be getting yourself by the end of the week, except for people that are in Europe. Um, but uh, I, whenever you see something that says lucky something, turn on your notifications. It'll be my next slab box, whatever it is. And I'm going to put, uh, it'll be like you get the slab. Basically, you're buying the slab shipped, okay, for a decent price. And then you're going to get a bunch of bonus exclusive covers that make the box worth double the retail, okay? Double the cost. And you get chances at winning virgins. That's the secret. It's extremely limited. There's going to be a couple prizes. So make sure to have your notifications on. I think the next batch, you want me to see what the next, love you, Gamma. Want to see what the next batch might be? Let's see. Let's see what's coming next. Since I got a couple me nots, let's look. Some minots. We got some minots. Minots. <laughs> oh, we got some minots up in this house. Biatch. Shit, we're going to have two. Let me show this. I don't talk to you much anymore, Gamma. I know you're busy, but goddamn, brother. Oh, I might have to open up the uh, this. Hang on. I'm not telling you to message me either. I'm too busy right now. But <laughs> so the first, okay. Here's what the possible. Uh, 
next lucky whatever box is going to be. Wait, that's the wrong one. Damn it. So, let's see. There's going to be a couple options. Son of a bitch. Okay, it's not showing, so you're in trouble. I don't know what I did. Uh, is it this one? This can't be this one. Okay, it says submission tracking. Let's look at this one. Share screen. There. Okay. So I'm getting two shipments. They haven't been graded yet, but my guess is they're almost all going to get 9 8. So um, the next lucky box, whatever it will be, I'll wait till I get it. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. There's 10 trade of Venom 28 with Venom on the variant. Then there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven of the version. Then there's some stuff that I already had that I, I was getting regraded because they're good books. So the next one will probably be 10 trade Venom 28 variants. 9-8. Hopefully they all get 9-8. And then I can do 10 boxes. One person will win a virgin and someone will win everyone, everything else. Now, there's also um, another box. Another box has so there's two potential boxes here. Okay, the another box has these juggernauts. Now here's the thing with these juggernauts. Those are the Kyle Hotz Amazing Spider-Man 300. They all have printing errors on it. So I took a gamble. They could all come back. Okay, but if not. There's going to be a bunch of those and virgins. And then I have um, the Fantastic Four Antithesis books. Remember those? With the cover? All those. And then, of course, some more 28. Oh, that could help, though. Uh, it could bring the, the box up, the next box up to 13 boxes. It just depends. And I may or may not drop the price. I'll probably drop the price a little bit. Um, but yeah, so I got 50 more books coming in the next couple weeks. I got a lot of other stuff too, but these are the ones that are kind of going to be shipped together. So that'll be the next box. So make sure to, um, turn your notifications on besides the, that, uh, besides that, um, that's it. This was a live show. It was real quick. I wanted to show you some little surprises, show you the hall. I got to get your guys stuff in an area where I can start boxing it and getting it ready. Super excited. Ship out your uh, boxes, but that was the unboxing portion. Might as well do get a video out of it, you know? So, uh, love you guys. Uh, if I can do the time this just right, I can make it a 30-minute video exactly. So, let's see if I can do it. Shit, I'm already not going to do it. All right, you guys. I'll see you later.